Recently, we talked to you about Heal Girl Summer and what's better self-care than skin. Girl, I've been struggling with my skin ever since I was pregnant with Mia. I get dark spots on my face and I have phases where they go away, but they're always lingering. So I struggle with discoloration in general. So we're super excited to try Clinique's even better clinical dark spot interrupter. If you have dark spots like me, it can often feel like a vicious cycle. As soon as one fades, another one pops up. Don't worry, girl. You can break the cycle with Clinique Even Better Clinical Dark Spot Interrupter. This powerful serum works on melanin-rich to fair skin and helps visibly correct dark spots, such as acne marks, while protecting from future discoloration. What I really like is that 94% demonstrated an improvement in their skin tone, including acne marks, in just eight weeks. And a 39% visible reduction in dark spots in 12 weeks. Clinique's damage eraser is now more concentrated with boosted technology to deliver dramatic brightening results, yet is still gentle enough for all skin types. This product features a brightening molecule and vitamin C for a more even-looking skin tone, including acne marks. Plus, it improves the look of existing dark spots, including age spots, while interrupting the look of future dark spots too. In just two and a half hours, it helps quell redness from irritation that can trigger new visible spots and worsen existing spots. The amazing thing about this product is that it is oil-free, not actogenic, it is a fast-absorbing serum, and it is dermatologist-developed. Get even better clinical dark spot interrupter today, available at Clinique.com. Girl, this morning I had a big old bowl of sucaritas. It was so good. Girl, don't you mean frosted flakes? Well, in our culture, girl, I've also heard los del tigre, so. And what do you call Fruit Loops? Fruity Loopies, mama. Oh, Los del Tucan, right? There you go. And I also really like the the rooster one. You mean cornflakes? Oh my god, wait, that is cornflakes. The rooster one is cornflakes, but we call well, it cornflakes. Well, we call it cornflakes. Well, let's keep it 100, girl. My mom called every cereal under the sun cornflakes. <laughs> the special K2. The special K2, girl. My mom called literally uh, growing up. Everything is cornflakes, period. Comment below. You already know. So, Mia, are you teaching her, like, the different flavors, or are you calling them alcohol flakes, too? I refer to them just like my parents did growing up, because I I actually find it really important to teach Mia both English and Spanish. Not just the language, but really incorporating, like, the lingo that we use. I will literally, like, bring out cereal and be like, you want conflays? You want socaritas? Because I want that implemented in her just like we grew up. Mm-hmm. And, Mama, that's why they say Kellogg cereals are on mom's tables aquí y allá. Period. Hello, primas. Welcome back to the podcast. I'll say hi to my special guest. <laughs> hey, y'all. You guys, we have motherfucking Peter, Peter Brand in the building today. Period. Which the you know, most requested. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> we need to learn. Stop talking. Oh. <laughs> the most requested Talk guest. A hunt. Yeah. The most requested. Most Stop. Most requested this is not to be guest. cheers and giggles. What is the it? Most- cheers, and, <laughs> cheers and giggles again? I thought he was saying cheers and giggles. I'm like, speaking of cheers, let's oh. cheers to this episode. <laughs> we start. What the fuck? I was going to say our most requested guest, James Charles. <laughs> <laughs> like, why? Girl, oh, I'm in I the flesh. I can't open this shit with these nails. <laughs> I just took my nails off. And they're like, you know what, Peter, when you take your nails off, your uh, nails are like so weak. Wait, we got your like part. paper bitch. Yes, Oof, I know what you're talking about. That's my hands right now. I have a little um sauce from Laura, ex pica pica. Her. Let's pour some of this, girl. Um, what was I gonna say? Aren't you guys gonna be trying some shit out today, girl? I brought a goodie bag. We already tried yeah. it. I'm not trying anything else. Oh. <laughs> Period. Okay. Know. Yeah. No, no. Peter. Peter pulls up like all his shit. I was like, period. <laughs> Let us know, Peter. What's up? It's been a long two years. I think <laughs> I haven't been on camera for a so... long time. I'm so nervous. By the way, I hope everyone knows this. Like, I'm really, really <laughs> shaky right now. Peter's like, it's I'm been a while. Oh. <laughs> you sound so incredibly crisp. I'm like, really? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh wow. Yeah. Okay, I, professionalism. I live for like her. I really just, I'm hearing every vibration right now, and I think I should every explain vocal, what's going on. Every vocal, Ariana Grande could never. <laughs> yeah, bitch, I can hear you breathing. Like, <laughs> back up a little bit. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. My bad. I'm new. <laughs> no, I'm here for the ASMR. I'm here for it. It's because Peter's mic is like... Um, it's distorted. I was gonna isn't go. the... <laughs> 
Am I too close? Started, no, it sounds good. But oh. that that mic that cream, remember that's the one they used to use for your ace in my video. Is this is like the bomb so one. She's like, Chris, mm-hmm. bitch. She cared everything. <laughs> everything. But, um, I, I wanna but s- welcome to Chits and Kick. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? You know what's going Why on, girl. We- Hold on. This is us. This is like our fucking friendship though. We're like a mess. We're always talking over each other. Well, and I feel like explain what happened. Yeah, what? So Peter oh, came yeah, over yeah. today. You know, him, me, and my mom are going through Peter's bag, which we want to do like a what's in my bag in a little bit. But uh, we're going through Peter's bag. <laughs> like, we're going through his bag? No, nah, not like that. <laughs> First of all, I opened the well, bag. Well, he was taking a little <laughs> bathroom break. Open. Like, Peter was showing us a little haul of his edibles and all kinds of stuff, you know. And my mom is queen of anxiety. <laughs> she, she has anxiety. She's always trying to, you know, try different things. Like mm-hmm. she's done like CBD. She's done like full blown like edibles with like THC and everything. Yeah. And she loves them. Mm-hmm. My mom loves edibles, y'all. Like, can everybody yeah. say that? My mom loves edibles. I was good. <laughs> so she really likes them and she's like pointing some out. She's like, what are these? Like, blah, blah, blah. So Peter ended up giving her edibles. Yeah. And Remember I told you guys that I really wanted to do an episode with an edible? Yeah. Well, a bitch Loki had one right before coming mm-hmm. on set to film. <laughs> Is and that why y'all are tripping the phone? That's I, what you're saying. I'm pretty you're, giggly, you're girl. Hearing, I'm like, laughing. I am so giggly right now. It's giggle city. I thought we were going to take giggle a lot city. of edibles, so I really brought a lot of edibles. No, Peter, like, give us a what's in my bag, because you have some good ass shit in yeah, there. Yeah, but I didn't know, like, Karina's tolerance is, like, really, like... You know. No, my tolerance. She's is a like mom. She's very, a mom. My tolerance. Well, tell them how you you have all this because you work at um a dispensary, right? That's right. I work at a legal dispensary in Wait. Pomona, California, called Catalyst. Curious? If you guys ever want to swing by, it's legal. You know, she was Wait. trapping for two years. I mean, I was at my A for a while. She was Period. out here doing some illegal work, the- girl, in the streets. <laughs> But I she's mean, better. She's but better. She, she's oh, getting better. Yeah. Yeah. Get, uh, what is it? Don't get bitter, get better. So yeah. I love that. So I know we used to I fundle a lot. With, no, no, no. We used to fundle a lot with tinctures and stuff. So that's like a lemonade. And oh that has 100 milligrams. Are we doing the what's in your bag? Right now? Yeah, 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 yeah. We're doing the what's guys. in the bag. So we're just showing everybody what's 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 your in the bag sweet bag. It's so cool, first of all. Really? It's so cute. So cute. I don't know who gave this. It's Shout like out to Florica. Where's your other one? The backpack that says fuck off? Oh, that's the that's my oh, regular that's backpack. Oh, that's a fucking vibe. This I thought the, you were going to bring this her. This has all the concha in here, girl. Cling. Ooh, what's in his bag? Mango lemonade. Yeah, got all the... The good shit. And this is not just regular lemonade, girl. No, it's infused with that one, girl. So, like, earlier I gave your mom CBN ones, which is just for sleep. Like, just insomnia. Uh, there's a lot of, of there's a lot of people with cancer who come in with munchies and stuff. So, you got to, like, specifically wow. recommend them different stuff. Because everything, psychotic. there's stuff wow. that's going to get you high. And there's stuff that's going to, like, relax you. Relax you. Exactly. Is it wow. CBN? Is that, like, CBD? Mm, it's different, right? Sort of, sort of not really, because CBD targets pain and muscles, Peter which Hattie CBM, so like, I'm gonna girl. <laughs> I'm gonna drink some of the some of the drink though, girl. This no, I can't, y'all. Like, I'm, I literally like, but I you had like less than half. Right? I think she had actually she had a seven ten gummy, and those are like really really strong, like super oh, duper strong. You're kidding! I, I literally. Swear oh my god, Peter, are you feeling I'm something? Too- yes, I'm like, wait. I feel like I took a whole one, and I didn't. I took like less than half. And I offered the rest to my mom, but she didn't want it, so I gave it to Peter. Like just knowing, like that my mom is like so cool about that, like yeah. edibles and stuff. I feel like my mom recently like has like gotten me to them, and like it's rare. I usually for gummies, I usually do CBD gummies. Yeah. But recently, my mom was like, "I'm actually doing the THC ones," and she'll be like, "Yeah, take one." My bad. Oh. Peter's like, he, oh even him just putting it on the table, like, boom, like, all that is period. But, yeah. And I'm like, I'm like, <laughs> damn, bitch, I heard that swallow. You got okay. a good This is a good mic. I like the mic. She got a good I'm throw. I'm more fan of the mic. <laughs> like, she, like, she has a good throw, like, mic. Here, should I just place Damn. Yeah, girl, I just throw them back over here. That mic <laughs> was my, well, is, like, the mic I use for filming my main channel videos. But um, yeah, she has slime on it, all kinds of shit. We're trying to work on getting another microphone like these. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I'm a fan. 
I'm a fan. Yeah, she's, I'm a huge she's fan. really crispy. Do you watch the podcast? I do. I do. I watch the podcast a lot. I'm a no fan. way. Yeah. Oh I watch, um, I'm not like a super fan where I read like, the <laughs> comments and stuff, but I know, I'm like, oh my God, this I'm is so relatable. <laughs> but I watch from a distance. From a distance. <laughs> I support from afar. <laughs> Queen. Oh my god, we have oh our white too. But oh, yeah. I mean, you ha- you have not read the comments because you are highly requested. Mm-hmm. And Peter oh, was no, actually shocked when we told him. So I'm like, maybe maybe he doesn't look at the comments. <laughs> no. Does somebody have the sauce? You know maybe what's he funny though? If, um, <laughs> so I don't do I don't really post on my YouTube channel anymore. Uh-huh. Fun with that. I haven't posted a video like in a while. How long has it been since you posted a video, Peter? Like a no. legit sit down. I post like little random little vlogs and those are like five minute videos. So like they're not really like considered anything, mm-hmm. but like a real sit down video. Like it's been two years, girl. No way. Yeah. Two years. The well, last story time was like two years ago. I, I would plan, even look chubbier. The like last my vlog. face looks thicker. <laughs> oh no, no. She's, she was eating good. <laughs> she was eating great. She you have lost eating. a lot of weight. Um, you did lose weight. How many pounds do you lose? I don't know, skinny queen. I couldn't tell you that much. Mm-hmm. I think because of COVID, because remember when I caught COVID and stuff like that, it was like the whole thing. Girl, if we go back in 2018, take me back. Wow. But yeah, COVID really shook our world. So do you plan on going back to YouTube? Mm, I'm trying, but I feel like being an influencer right now is it's really hard. hard. It's hard. And the thing with being an influencer, it's following trends, right? You always have to be mm-hmm. on top of the trends. Yeah. And no one's really watching YouTube videos like that anymore. I was going to say, like, 100%. I feel like... People are moving on to like TikTok, like that's I reels, mean, you know, Instagram reels just came out with the thing and they're, they're paying a, a lot of micro influencers they are. a lot. They are. Didn't they hit you up? They did. The reels? Yeah. yeah. Peter gets paid for his reels. I got, I actually got stopped being monetized because I was going against the community guidelines, but. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Why? They, they're just not cannabis friendly. It's I was like the cannabis I, halls weren't working out. Really. Yeah, girl. She got to post something else. So like oh makeup, God. here I come. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but yeah i feel like youtube i noticed a lot of like influencers you go through to their youtube and like they haven't posted in months mm-hmm. i think it's just not like a thing anymore my main channel like you're lucky if you get one video a month. <laughs> but, but my vlog tested. channel like i post consistently yeah on my my on my main channel it's like i try to do weekly i try really hard but it's always like i'll be like shit it's been a month i gotta mm-hmm. upload yeah. you know something comes up like it's yeah. so random but like life gets real and then you're like uh Eh. Yeah. No, just gotta yeah. post something else here you know what i mean and everyone's on tiktok yeah. anyway and doing yeah. the reels like no one has time to watch a 13 minute video I feel on like how to blend people, eyeshadow time scan time scan time spam time, time spam spam yeah. spam, spam. 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 <laughs> i love spam <laughs> wait that shit is Speaking bomb on google <laughs> <laughs> scam you guys like spam <laughs> what I Do love spam. Don't you I'm put good. that in your noodles? Yeah, we used to put that in the spicy How does noodles, the, huh? Uh, green eggs and ham go? What? Green eggs and ham semi up? No. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what you're talking about. No, I'm sorry. The again. edibles are hidden, mama. Well, again, anyways, she does what not the fuck was I talking about? Uh, attention span. Attention oh. span. People's attention spans on TikTok now have gotten like really. That's why nobody watches YouTube videos anymore. I could just yeah. go on TikTok, watch like a five second video. Mm-hmm. Well, aren't they like a minute now or something or longer? Aren't they like three minutes now? They're three minutes now. And even then I'm like, skip. Gotta bye. go. Gotta you can go. even like uh, scroll through it I'm now like, on the bottom. Scroll like, through. I'm like, this is girl, too long for the what? Updates. The updates. Like here we were complaining about part one, part two, part three. Like that's why they did the long ones. Girl. Girl. And people out here really doing like fucking 10 parts still. I'm like, y'all. I can't. I can't do Continuing that. Continuing for ten minutes long, girl. I remember I watched the whole season of Euphoria on TikTok straight up. Like, no, <laughs> <laughs> not the whole season. Season two was just being spoiled for me, just going through God, her. I, I do that sometimes when I find a movie, and then like before I know it, like I'll literally be watching a whole ass movie on TikTok. Like, <laughs> like we find out so much on TikTok. Girl. Each one's like fifteen seconds long. Like, damn. Period. <laughs> but you guys are not gonna take. I thought you guys were gonna take the edibles on camera. Uh, eight. No. I'll take. Away. I'll take another one. Uh, take they're it. strong. Though. <laughs> oh like, my god. I the can't. thing is that they're scary because they're really strong. But... No, Peter. It's okay if you can't. It's no, okay. I'm down. Oh. I'm, girl, she got a high tolerance. <laughs> <laughs> no, Period. Like, I can't. I didn't even take half of one, and I'm like, oh my god, what the fuck is going on? No, Peter, you do have a high tolerance. What is that? Is that a lot? Okay. It's just a full. It's just ten milligrams. So there's like a hundred in the whole thing. Oh my god! Mm. Can love... we get a little ASMR? Yeah, give us an ASMR. Mm. 
Queen. Queen. <laughs> I love it. I, love I, it. I can't take edibles because I hella panic. Like, I remember uh, one time. Let's talk like about I the can. time. Let's talk about that, bitch, because that was my first and last time now ever. that's a story, girl. But you need I, to go in depth because you drink a good amount of this lemonade. Yeah, this so like, they were having, like, lemonade. What the fuck is it called? Just lemonade? Like, right? Peter like, had introduced us to, like, a lemonade. That yeah, it was lemonade, and I was like, it was my first time, first and fucking last. I was like, I guess I'll try it, but I didn't think it was going to be, like, crazy. I took, like, a couple gold. Like, not sips. Like, it was gulps. Oh and I fucking panicked. I was fine at first. And then I remember... Let me let me picture the scenario. Because I remember we were, like, hanging out. Literally here. Yeah. This is where I used to live. This studio. Mm-hmm. And, like, this was my living room. And I oh remember... We, we were literally right here in this room. Your TV was right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I remember, like, we were watching a movie or something. Right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And at some point, I was just, like, sitting down. And, like... It hit me like a fucking train. It was like, it wasn't just, no, it was out of nowhere. And I remember like Peter like laughed. And you know how some people were like laugh, like, ah, like, and I think like that triggered it. And it. Peter like laughed loud. And I remember like from there, I was like, oh, like what happened? That, that was like my trigger. I know it sounds crazy. Like okay. I always tell him, I'm like, your laugh like triggered it. Like, I don't know why. Like, and I remember thinking, like, I, I was like hallucinating. I literally like felt like Peter, like, it was so loud. Like, I almost felt like it was like a gunshot. It was so crazy. I'm like, what was like hallucinating? In my head, I was like, somebody came in. Like, this is how bad I was. I was like, somebody came in, shot Peter, and now I'm like looking at his soul, and I got shot too. And like, we're all souls wandering. It was so trippy. I remember so you, trippy. you kept telling us it's an out of body experience. Yeah, for you. I felt like, like I, I was floating here. Like. And Brian was trying to like, like grab me, like pick me up. And I, I, I thought it was Jesus Christ, like into the heavens, bitch. Like for real. I'm like, I really thought I was like, this, <laughs> this is was God. Some, this was a trip. This was a trip. Girl. I remember he was like telling me to come here. And I was like, oh my God. I remember looking around like I'm dead. And this is off. Like I'm dead. Lemonade, like right? God's picking me up. Like I swear lemonade that was a really okay. strong lemonade Karina. like i, I don't remember, know what like, the fuck y'all had in there really, really imagine strong. shrooms even dude? crystal that night oh, met, she God. came over that day she was like and she just got in a car crystal accident had, and she yeah. was like i could feel my neck again guys yeah and she her <laughs> neck was fucked up the next day we ended up having breakfast remember we went to go eat breakfast and i remember i was like oh shit like i was feeling good i'm like i feel high but like i'm feeling good and i realized i'm like this is how i'm supposed to be feeling like the night before i remember like Brian took me to bed. I was like trembling in my sleep. Like tre- I was shaking. Literally. I didn't just feel it. I was literally trembling. And then the next morning, that's when I felt the high was good. And I'm like, this is how a high is supposed to feel. But I was freaking the fuck out. It was so much. Like I'm assuming it had a lot of that shit in there. Cause I mean, it was a couple gulps, but for it to fuck me up like that. I remember that thing was strong. Like, it was strong. But, like, strong. everybody was, like, Peter has a high tolerance, and the fact that Peter was crawling all over the fucking floor, like, like yo. I, do you guys remember that one time that me and Andrea invited you guys out to Halloween Horror Nights, and her date, like, <gasps> pop, yes, like had, yes. like, a whole episode in the line, and you guys yes. just got there. And he was and, tripping yeah, on it, huh, And too. he was tripping on the lemonade. That lemonade, oh that same thing. So, it's like, yeah. oh, girl. That, that lemonade, bitch. That, there's, well, you can't and even find it And the fact that anymore. it was my you first time trying it yeah. like my yeah. first time bitch that had to hit like 10 times harder girl that's a trip that's a like, trip right there a fucking trip so i never again after that smoke like it just ever, scarred you it like, scarred me for life yeah and people tell me because i have anxiety they'll be like just drink it i mean drink it <laughs> hell no <laughs> <Just> drink <laughs> it. no not drink it they'll be like just smoke it like just smoke you know weed. oh no that would be even more and of a like, trigger and i'm like no i can't like i wish i wish I, I wish i could take like edibles and stuff to like calm me down i'm like no i already fucking know the trip i went through <laughs> i'm like i ain't fucking doing it my I body just, just don't like my it. my body just rejects that shit yeah. i just can't i yeah. had a horrible trip i wish i could though like i wish i could be like a smoker because people like i mean it sounds fucking chill you know like before you go to sleep take a little hit or wake and bake <laughs> but, yeah. well, that's rose but like vibe. rose vibes very like before going to sleep he'll go to the balcony brian when he plays his games with the guys like on their what is that thing like what yeah, is that game called um he'll take his couple hits on my goals like he'll sleep in peace and all i'm uh, like i could never yeah, right. we'll be like he will be like in a really good mood and i'm like what's wrong i'm like oh okay What's wrong? Not no, what's wrong? Uh, what's wrong? Like, like, if it's bad, like, he's not good. Why are y'all giggly? Uh, I'll just be like, why you, you look so happy? You, know, just, you listen no. to your chins and giggles? <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. 
dead. No, I'll just be like, what's up with you? And then I'm like, oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, Peter, we actually do this every week where we talk about how was our week. So I know we're like 30 minutes in this video, but what's up? <laughs> I know, huh? Like, we should start this week. How was my week? Are how you guys was asking it? me? How yeah. was my week? How was your um, week? What was your week? What do you guys? Oh, my week was fun. It was stressful. Um, I deal with a lot of people every day, so you know, a lot of a lot of patience. Mm -hmm. um, I had a good week, though. I mean, tips are fun. You know, <laughs> we love a good tip. Tell um, them tip your tender. Yeah, tip your tender, yeah. girl. Um, tell you what. No, go ahead. I didn't, I didn't mean to cut you off. No, <laughs> keep. I'll, I'll ask you after. I don't know. Being a bud tender is like really different from being like a bartender or like uh -huh. being a server. You're not really giving someone food. You're giving someone like medicine, but like yeah. it's not medicine. You know, a lot of people treat it like medical now, mm -hmm. so it's different. What but is, um, oops, sorry. I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. I was say, tell them what a bud tender is. Yeah. Ooh, a person who legally sells marijuana in California. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Period. Um, we sell a lot of like tropicals, a lot of edibles, a lot of mm -hmm. flour. There's a lot of cannabis. Um, if not that, there's uh, like concentrates, like pens and stuff. We have a lot of stuff. Period. Yeah. Tell us about the trap days. Tell us. Girl. I know you got some crazy stories up your Okay, sleep. hold up. The trap <laughs> is like, I don't know so if I can talk about this. different. Are we able to talk about Are we about able to talk about a trap? No, yeah, I think we can. Like, we just can't share like too much, but this mm -hmm. is crazy. Like, I mean, at the trap, like <laughs> now you deal with people who are like sophisticated professional people who like, you know, work at the trap house. It was like a bunch of crackheads who would just come <laughs> and pick up like <laughs> stuff. So like, you know, it was different. <laughs> Not the crackheads. Yeah, like straight up crackheads, like asking for like just drugs. Like it was bad. It was bad. We would get raided. You guys ever knew what a raid was? That's I think all I bad. Found yeah. out I you. think I heard. Yeah, yeah. Through you. I didn't know of all this. I thought the actually we started out cute though. The legal shops, the the trap shop started cute. Like she uh -huh. was pink inside. Uh -huh. She said she seemed like legal vibes, but she wasn't legal vibes. I was gonna mention because when you said that, how we said that they would even go like, and you were like, yeah, these crackheads, blah blah. blah. You guys would not sell drugs, right? Like y'all sold like weed. No, just weed. Like okay. it was just weed and like shroom bars at the worst. But like the cops thought we had like you know perico and like mm -hmm. um. Yeah. pills and like all this other shit but because it was kind of ugly i mean she got ugly with time but like in in, in the the triumph days she was cute she, we would give her a 10 yeah, she ate. the <laughs> fact that she well, what was your first experience like when y'all got raided oh my god i was scared i was like i can't afford bail <laughs> what what, i gotta go karina <laughs> she gonna do what is she gonna what am i gonna tell her um girl when we first got arrested uh we actually Wait, didn't you got get, no we didn't get arrested By we got way, handcuffed it I wasn't like 100 baby girl i know yeah. but like the girl this, this was so bad this was so bad um we got handcuffed and they all let us know like what are you guys doing here like we all told them that we were just customers like i don't know who works here. i'm not a manager like i don't know i don't know who owns the place i was like you go on my instagram You're store like, you see me on the pole <laughs> Hi, welcome. Hi, like, welcome. girl, the whole welcome, everything. Um, yeah, she got caught. <laughs> so I had to. <laughs> How many times did you get raided being there? Literally a lot. Like, it got hot. Like, after after 420 of this year, <laughs> it was like, I had to get out of there, like, bad. Oh, shit. They were getting hit, like, every week. Oh, and then yeah. you also, in general, like, you wanted to, like, you know, like, do it legally instead yeah. of Yeah, like, instead of, like, yeah. also, girly, because, um, a lot uh, this is a, this should be announced to a lot of people anyone picking at illegal dispensaries they have fungus in their weed like a lot of my patients that came back to catalyst were like yeah babe like i got this weird uh virus in my lungs because i was smoking all the Stop. trapped weed <laughs> what the fuck wait, wait yeah what? like well there's weed out there that goes bad like shit gets moldy like naturally yeah. everything rots so like <gasps> we were still selling like you know just selling shit like so yeah. things got bad. There was mold in the edibles. Like it wasn't, and nothing, oh, everything was regulated. Oh, you know? It was an extra Yeah. Like, we were selling like trip. 500 milligram edibles, but like those aren't legal in California. So yeah, things so like that. So it ain't like wine, the older it gets. No, finer, girl, it ain't fine wine up in this <laughs> house, girl. No, no, no. She got, oh. an, exper she got an expiration date for oh sure. Oh my <laughs> God. Like not at the trap. Straight not up. you suggesting them like, no, please don't shop here. <laughs> yeah, like stop. Don't do this to them. Like, yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, and then obviously, like, I would tell, like, my managers or whatever, and, like, they wouldn't care. Because they just want, they yeah, just want money. I mean, they're just trying to get their coin. Yeah, they're just trying to get their coin, mama. Oh, my God. Rent's got to be paid. Period. <laughs> it's got to be paid, bitch. Wow, that's crazy. Oh, do. um, do you, I mean, I remember, I actually, we did, I was the one that kind of got us caught. Because, like, I had a couple viral TikToks oh. that went really good. Yeah. Do you guys remember oh the God. number? The one where you fell off the pole. Yes. Yes. Yeah. They, oh my God. they found th- out from that TikTok. Oh, my God. And we were getting rated more. And we were got rating more. And people kind of clicked the lines together. They didn't want to say that, like, I was working there because I, yeah. I could be like I wasn't. Yeah. But like, I'm still not. And you were like, I'm hi, still, welcome. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just here for fun, just on the pole. Yeah. Uh, I learned how to strip, how to, you know, be. Uh, what yeah. is it called? Go on the pole, like yeah, period. Dance on the pole. Dance on the pole. Learn some tricks. So go upside down. It's fine. Wow. You do yeah. some cool ass tricks. Do they have a pole in the one that you work at? No, that's. It's, I don't think that's legal to have a stripper pole. In, oh, in is a, it not? A, oh, no, okay, I don't think period. so. Yeah, but I wish. Girls, tip me a five. I'll get on that pole again. <laughs> Wait, so is this trap still going right now? No. Or? Um, <laughs> they are, like, they the are people? the people, but, like, Different that, location? Exactly. Exactly. Oh, so it was raided, raided. Damn. Mama, it was ghetto. And when I talk about mm-hmm. ghetto, like... Think about like <laughs> Karina will open up a house in the back and like just start selling back there, girl. Like that, it was ghetto like that. Period. Oh yeah. shit! In Pomona, like backyard. Yes, moment. that's what I'm trying to say. Like shit. it was ghetto. Like it was ghetto. Uh, there was a point where we were like on a re- on a generator. We were, we were running on a generator. Like the whole store was running on a generator, and oh. then the cops would take the generator. Then we had to like get a oh battery my generator. God. It was ghetto, girl. You oh, wanna- so they couldn't coll- connect to like real light because exactly because the city wasn't gonna gonna provide the electricity, girl, What's for this so illegal building. Illegal yes, it's Whoa. crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. I didn't know it was like that out there. Yeah. Also, there's another. Um, I don't know. Then also, like you know, people get t- handsy, girl. There was this one time where like. A senorita, like, uh, have you guys ever seen Snow White? <laughs> yes. Have you seen when she takes the apple from this really scary old lady? Mm-hmm. But Snow White's sweet and she's like, give me the apple. Uh-huh. That was me. Aww. That was me. So this sweet little old lady with no teeth comes in the shop and like she wants to pick up her little eighth, right? She's like, give me, give me an eighth. And, um... You know, she has her phone or whatever, and she did. To me, she didn't look homeless. Like it's kind of hard to tell when people look homeless because you know, like they're genuinely sweet, and you're just like, oh, yeah. like you just want something, you know. But uh, <laughs> it wasn't until she was like, "You're so pretty. You look like James Charles," and like nothing, <laughs> nothing at the end. So she would like, "You look like oh James," and like, and I was like, "Thanks, queen. <laughs> no. Like, here's your eighth. Give me twenty five bucks or whatever." Oh, um, and God. then pobrecita, dude, she um. She like was like, I just can't believe you're real. And me, me agarró mi cabeza. And like, she was like grabbing. And I knew she was homeless because like her hands were all black. And like she had like shit really under her thought, fingernails and shit. She really thought and she was like, I can't believe you're real. <laughs> like grabbing my face. And That's then so like cute. the minute she let go of my face, I was like, bitch. Like <laughs> I have foundation. <laughs> Why would you grab me? <laughs> and I was like, I can't believe you touched my face. Don't you ever. And I freaked out on her like. Why would she touch my face and stuff like that? And now oh I turn like God. I look back and I'm like, I'm so sorry. Like Oh, you freaked out on her. Yeah. Face. Yeah. Like I was like, don't touch anybody. Like, don't ever touch nobody. Like, who do you <laughs> no. think you are touching people? I mean, it is not like Peter, it like, is like, disrespectful, like, you know, touching somebody's face. Like, that's so it weird. Not me so being weird. a whole like moment. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I then, mean, it would throw anybody off. I was sure. like, here's your flower. Like, here it is. And like, I didn't throw it at her, but I was like, here it is. And like she salió, and then she came back and that whole like every Friday we would throw like big old events and like have like a taco stand and all this stuff mm-hmm. vino por atrás and she still asked for a plate of tacos I get, well I gave her a plate of tacos but I was like here you go girl I'm sorry oh my god she's probably like oh fuck yeah, fucked yeah. Up. like maybe I shouldn't have touched his face <gasps> did we mention Peter was our cousin or no, did we, we forget didn't. that I feel like the introduction was a hot mess this is James um, <laughs> James Charles. Oh, that's where I was gonna go too when you were talking about um that you look like James Charles. You get that a lot. A all lot. the time. Do all you still time. get it till this day? All the time. Every single day. Like even working at the legal dispensary, everyone thinks that, oh my god, his YouTube channel's gone down in flames. Now he's working and I'm selling dead. weed. Oh my <laughs> god, didn't you see the other day? They knew you were Peter. Um Honey Boo Boo? Yeah, honey. Oh my God, honey. Boo Boo was there too, girl. Yeah, Her sister Pumpkin went. walked in. They were, they were, they thought Karina was the one that had catalyst because they were like, "Oh, Peter's here." Like, I was like, "Girl, they're over here putting Not puzzle pieces and other things." Slime warehouse. I was yeah. like, <laughs> 
like plain. So that's why they make the slime. Oh my god. I'm done. But yeah, Peter's our cousin, you guys. Um, it's funny because Peter's like our gay best friend, obviously. But yeah. like he's our actual well, realistically, we're your tia. Yeah. Which is yeah. so weird. But we're like how do I party with age. my aunt? That's so like, crazy. That's, that's yes. so weird. But like, we're kind of close in age, mm-hmm. so it feels like we're cousins. Like, yeah, Peter, you're what? Like, just a few years younger, like three years. Three years younger. I'm 25. Yeah, like not even Luis, which is four years older than us. So it's like, I, I that's so weird. I feel yeah. like if Peter ever called this day, it would be weird. Like, it's yeah. just weird. I don't Peter know. is our uh, well, your mom is our cousin. So yes. we're like, yeah, like his mom's yeah. our cousin. So we are his aunts technically, but we always just say like He's gay best our friend, cousin, or yeah, cousin. Our gay best friend. Cause like when we're just like thrive, I'm like I don't just see Peter as a cousin though. I see him as like no, my it's best like friend. an actual best friend. Cause yeah. like he's in our group chat with like our friends. Yeah, that like part. like I forget we're family and we see him like that gay best friend. Yeah, like like it's even so crazy. if we were not family, like I could a hundred percent see us be friends. You know what I mean? A hundred percent. But Peter, let's take it all the way back because. I want to say, um, I, I think I remember the day that you came out to us. I was about to bring that up right now, too. I was like, I speaking of how close we are. Like, yes. Okay. So, yeah. Do you want to, like, explain to them? Like, because I know, obviously, like. This was like, you know, how I had to be at least, what was it? 17, 18. This but that's was when you came out to makeup. us, right? This was before even starting a YouTube channel. Yeah. This is just, like, just to you guys. Because we were, like, <laughs> yeah. you guys were living back in the trailer. No, no, no. no. You guys were in the. We were. You, but we were at Lupita's when yeah. you told us. Oh. Okay. Remember? Oh, yes. that's okay. Yeah, yes. it was a party, no? That's different. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I but had that. you you already had came out to your family? So tell us about how you came out um, in general, if you're open to it. So, well, I came out to my mom when I was 13. So this was like Lupita's birthday. This is the the neon party. That day you came out to her? No, to you guys, right? Oh, at yeah, the neon yeah, yeah. party, right? Yes. Right? No, no, no. The I came out to party. my mom. The I could think a couple of weeks before that because it was my birthday. So mm. I was texting a guy. I was in middle school. Oh my god. Yeah. And I was texting someone that lived in, what was it at the time? Santa Ana, girl. And I was living in Chino. So that was a little far. I think we met like off of Facebook. And yeah. um, I had a couple girlfriends. That's the thing, too. Like a lot of people think Period. that like I dated men my whole life and I've only been with men. Yeah. I've been with women. It's which like, is, I had a lot of bitches. Yeah, yeah. which is scandalous. <laughs> um, so like, have you like, like slept with women? I have slept with one girl my entire life. Wait, wait. I thought I knew this shit. Wait, <laughs> you not, never told us this shit. I did not wait, know about this. Wait, wait, what? Wait, wait, okay, Peter, I feel TMI, like... TMI, but yeah, it happened. What? This yeah. happened recently, not like a while ago. But like, recently? Like, recently? Is recently? that why we're pretty finding out? Because yeah, it was girl, recent? Girl, I changed. Wait, 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 wait. No, okay. You gotta tell us this a, shit. It was a drunk well, moment. Okay, let's talk about... But it was a friend oh. that I still talk to to this day, and it was like, it was just, we're cool. Like, it's nothing, it's nothing crazy. Wait, how long ago was this? Um, I had to be 22, so like... Wait a minute. Wait... <laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on. You no, got to I have no person? nails. Yes. Stop. <laughs> no, Stop. No. Yes. No, I no. You guys can guess who it is. I like, know who it is. <laughs> wait, wait, Peter. So, yeah, this was recent because, yeah, you I, you definitely would have already told us She's if we had drunk, asked you. Girl. I mean, wait, hold on. Sexuality so, is a spectrum. So, uh, who, who orchestrated this? Like, who was like, <laughs> did it just like randomly happen? This literally happened. I don't know how to explain it. Like it just it's fucking. Hold happened. on, hold on. I know, we but like drinking. I need to know the fucking she details. She was in her feelings. I was in my feelings, and then we kissed, and then yeah. But I wasn't in makeup though. Like I was full Peter, like just Peter, oh no nails. God. It's just so funny because like I can't picture it. But I know. I feel like I you told like you've always told us like I would never. Yeah. We haven't hung out in a long time. We have. I oh, feel like we do. Like- we do hang out, but. Not like often as we used to. Yeah. yeah. There's like, yeah. 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 Oh, oh my God. Wait, the fact that like you didn't tell us this, like this is crazy. I thought this, this would like, have never happened. I thought I was like just strictly dickly. No, like <laughs> go the fuck off. But like the fact that we're just hearing it right now, I'm like, what? Yeah. I was even mind blown too when it happened because the next day I was like. Uh, ha- like how did you bring it up to? Nothing. Sure. I think we kind of moved on, but like we were just like, we're just really close friends. Like we were just drunk. Nothing crazy. I have so many questions like that I want to ask, but I know off it's like camera. probably first off okay. camera. Period. I wore a condom. We're good. Oh, t- I mean, do you? But that's like, 
Oh my god, oh my gosh. Like, how does it like okay <laughs> this is my first I've seen like, it in movies and how, like is I it think what I you thought in, it was? Yeah, I I think it uh, I don't like it. <laughs> Yeah. Like, did you like Guys. genuinely feel like when it was happening where you're like, what the fuck am I doing? Or like, how did it feel? Yeah, exactly. I don't know what the fuck you're doing, but so dick is um, better. I mean, naturally for me, this is how this is how you know that I'm gay <laughs> because I like to be penetrated and not penetrate. Does okay. that make oh, sense? Okay, So how oh, okay, was that? So you're, like, yeah, you're a bottom. Yeah, like, I'm a bottom period. Like, I like period. to be fucked. Yeah. I don't I don't want to fuck. Yeah. I don't like to put me, in the effort, I girl. I don't want to care if you feel good. I'm just kidding. I want to feel good. Mean <laughs> shit. Is Fuck that selfish? Oh, no. no. Like, you know what you, you know want. What you want. Yeah. Oh. And then I, girl, I couldn't even eat her out. I felt bad. I was like. <sighs> I so, mean, yeah, it's like, it's boobs, I'm sure it's so different. Like okay. Like, yeah. Yeah. So it was just straight to the point. I mean, if you were sucking some titties, yeah. I would be like, what's going on? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, girl. Yeah. yeah. It was just. So it was just straight to the point. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's yeah. why it made me realize, like, okay, there's like a man body and then there's like a female body. Like, it's wait, different. this is like a like TMI, but did you finish? <gasps> no, no, oh, no, no. That's okay. that's what I'm saying. Like, I can't even count it. So you were like, like, that's what I say. We were drunk. It was I think just like it was fun. just for fun. Where you were like, yeah, you just want to try something it. new. Yeah, like, I mean, sexuality is a spectrum. Fuck it. Yeah, like, of course. Period, Peter. Yeah. I love that. You know, well, at least you got that off her, your chest. Uh, like you already know, like what it's like. You're like, I didn't like up. it. Move on to dick again. Period. 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 Now, now I know. You know, gotta try it. Yeah, period. you tried it already. You're like, this is what it's about. Don't knock it till you try it. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> period. Oh my god, that's crazy. But let's go back to how when you came out. Um, you said you were thirteen. Thirteen years old. Yeah. yeah. Texting a boy. Um. This is how I came out to my mom. And, like, the thing is, too, like, you guys all know, we are we come from a very traditional family. Like, tra- very traditional very Mexican. Traditional. F- they yeah. wear cowboy boots. They have horses. You know, they're all about the Mexican pride and stuff. So when Peter okay. decided to become Peter, it was, like, a huge, huge thing for my family. A lot of people don't know that... Um, my mom wanted to put me through conversion therapy you know no. that was a thing but i told her straight up like i like boys the way i'm supposed to like girls that's the first thing i told her and i got period. that straight period. that part i got that straight from glee <laughs> <laughs> Thank it's you. Actual thing from glee? i think it's like a quote but like it's like it. the way it. santana comes out to her mom or whatever but i, love it. I was like thank you glee i love that um but wow. yeah literally because of glee that's why i just found myself and like oh i i knew what being gay was i just didn't know like how to i still don't know what it is to be in a relationship but you know I know that I just I'm not gonna like girls, period. So when you know, you know. He's like, trust me, I tried it out. Yeah, I tried it, girl. <laughs> like that shit. I was born this way. Absolutely, yeah. that part. Yeah. yeah. And then the day that you came out to us, we were at um, Lupita was having a birthday party. Her yeah. birthday. What was it? Yeah. Her, like, it was 18th um, birthday. I think it was. I don't know, but I just remember you came up to us. We were in the and- kitchen. <gasps> Yeah, and goodness. you were like, you guys, I need to tell you guys something. Yeah. And then in my head, I'm obviously like, oh, he's going to he's gonna come out to us, you know? Yeah, yeah. And uh, you say it, and it, I remember you were, like, so nervous. I was like, Peter, oh, it's I okay. Know. I was a baby. And then when you finally said it, I was like, Peter, I've been knowing, like, yeah, you know? Yeah, like, you guys were so accepted. Yeah, oh. of course. Like, I was like, oh, my God, I was Peter, so scared. Well, because my mom was so negative towards it, y'all. She literally, like, shut everything down. Like, oh, I God. even think... I even, oh my God, you guys are going to be like, what the fuck? Like back then I wanted to get back into makeup. Like when I was freshly like starting out my thing, I wanted to do makeup way back then. But my mom yeah. said like, no, my son's not going to do makeup. My mom, my son's not going to date men. Like, do not tell your grandpa yeah. this. Like, you know, very traditional. Like we're going to fix you. Like I was broken. Mm-hmm. But um, yeah, no, with time, with it being 2022, things change. Yeah. And either like you you live with it or i'm living yeah. without you and now look at you with this be- beautiful face mama thriving uh, fucking queen driving around you know yeah i love it wow. that's the thing too and now like, it's changed too right like everybody's more accepting and stuff um, yeah how would you how would you say it's now i don't know i think it's a whole confidence roller coaster because not even like it's a whole confidence thing mama i think at this point like i want to um, put what I want to receive out there. So like if if I'm helping someone else, someone else is going to help me. You know what I mean? Like if I'm going to help another gay guy or another little gay teen figure himself out, be like, oh my God, like he's wearing makeup and I want to wear makeup. Like mm-hmm. do it. Like there's so many straight men at my work that want to put on just black nails. And I'm like, do yeah. it. Like 
why not paint your nails black there's so many tiktok boys that do it like what is wrong with being a little feminine you know what I mean? Like, yeah. literally, I don't get what the whole stereotype with about men. Why can't Seriously. men be emotional? You could even, you could yeah. literally even like, you could be. Um, oh my god, I lost my. Channel. I was just telling Brian that you the could other be day. Femi- feminine. I, I was like, like, shit. Like, I wish I could like, you know, put some concealer on you and like little things like that. I'm like, without people being like, oh, he has makeup on, he's gay. Yeah, I feel like and even if like, I was a straight man, like I feel like I'd still wear some concealer, bitch. Like. Uh, how like there. bad bunny and like edwin gus how they'll be painting their nails i'm like i like that shit dyeing like, their hair but like to yeah. other people be like oh he's gay because like, you fucking can't blonde. even do it because they're like wow, weirded yeah. out about it like that's so know? true yeah Pe- people are crazy dude yeah like who said so makeup was just for girls like come on now yeah i don't know it's it's crazy yeah but it's like how peter said like you can't even be like slightly feminine because then yeah. people are like you're gay you even know? like even going to work, like going to work, I go to work like this, guys. You guys know this. I, I have it. a nine to five. I, I clock I in, clock out. It. But she's, you know, her little influencer it. moment. Queen, <laughs> but it. like, I feel like I bring either the guys' confidence on my work at a ten or a three. Like they can't, mm-hmm. they can't match with me. Like I don't know if that makes sense because yeah, yeah, they feel I'm intimidated. Exactly, I'm too f- much. Like I'm too feminine, yeah. and it's oh not like God. I'm too gay. Like it's just like. You're just being you. Yeah, I'm just a lot. Like, why do they all of a sudden feel uncomfortable? Mm-hmm. Like, but and it's like the girl, uncomfortable thing of it's like. How do you deal with shit, that? Though. Like, That's, how do you deal with like, um, because obviously there's fucking rude ass people. Yeah. Um, how do you deal with that when you have someone that's like, um, being I smoke. Like, <laughs> period. <laughs> period. I'm I here for it. smoke. Do you remember that time at um, Rosarito too? Yeah, like that guy. Um, yeah, how, how he was like partying with us. Like, well, he went from like like drinking to getting tacos to come getting more drinks with us and then all of a sudden he got too lit and he said something wrong and brian was like i'm shutting that down immediately yeah like, he how was dare like you? i don't know what he said he made a comment and brian was like no 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 i think brian like even like fucking pushed him i don't know what i think yeah, like, yeah no like i was like damn like because it was like, bad if i could remember it, it was it was bad but like it it's like, just weird how people are like so like fucking rude mm-hmm. no but remember that time in miami the guy that was like, like he was like eating Peter with his eyes, and he had a girl. That was and bad. the girl was trying to have you know Peter, what, and the though? girl was, was like so lit. fucking. Peter was like, pose I was and twerking lit. and shit. Cause he, I looked because the bitch was fucking giving Peter dirty looks. Because obviously her man was looking, so Peter was like, "Well, let me give you a real show." Yeah, and then Period. she was talking shit about Graciela because, like, Graciela, like, I don't know. And she was talking shit about Graciela, and then I was like, "Why are you mad? Like, you're just fucking." The bitch was hating. a fucking like, you're hater. Just a fucking hater. And like but the her, man, her man the, licking his Peter. lips, literally licking his lips, like, literally eating Peter with his eyes. I didn't even upload that vlog because we're <laughs> no, but like mess, Peter was but, like fully giving a show, bitch. I was yeah. like, period. Because at some point it's and like, well, I was damn, giving, bitch, you're like, mad. Let me show you. I was giving mask energy. She was wearing like a collared shirt, not crop top, nothing. I just had lashes on. Like that was it. Peter's like, that's all I had to do. Imagine me. <laughs> Clap these little cheeks real quick and boom. Gotta go. <laughs> I love but yeah. It. To you, oh my god. Okay, so you know how they, they there's this saying that like um what did, what, did, what have you said? That you are able to turn a gay no, a straight man gay. Right? Is that what it is? Yeah, how do that, you feel? There's a saying. How do you feel like about like do you feel like sometimes there's people where you're like, I know I could turn you fucking gay? No, I think it's just like a, it's a whole attraction thing. I think with age, like now I'm starting to realize things differently. And like at the time when I was 18, yeah, like I would be like, I could turn any straight man DL. But it's more just like attracted. Like if you're attracted to someone, you're going to, you're going to precede that. You know what I mean? Like it's not right because you could be. You could look at me, and I'm not gonna like instantly turn you. Like it's gonna, yeah. there's gonna be something there that you want from me, like that attracts Period. you. Either the lashes, the lips, like Period. the ch- fucking glitter. <laughs> I don't know, girl. Sure. I know you've told us some stories, and I know a lot of these straight men in your DMs are, you know, straight, right? As they say. Yeah. But when it's time to get down and dirty, it says a little different. So. What you got to say about that? Does that make them bisexual? I don't know, but they identify with whatever they want to identify, yeah. I guess. Like whatever you say you are, you, it's whatever you're happy with. Yeah. Um, I'm happy with just being whatever I am to you and like it's fine. Period. And like I'm not looking for a relationship right now. So like as long as you both know what you guys both are looking for, nothing gets 
conflicted, then, mm. you know, go off. Yeah. I know I was going to ask you right now, how's your love life? I think you answered that for us. Oh, my God. She's dating. Oh, uh, so she is dating. Okay. Y- yeah, she's dating. Uh, <laughs> oh, um, yeah, she's she's seeing somebody now. I met him at oh the shop, God. which is so kind of cool. Um, yeah, you guys saw my whole transition through everything. Um, yeah. mm-hmm. Relationships are hard. They are. But are uh, as long as you can get back on your feet and yeah, try 100%. something new, you know, it's everything. Oh, my God. I'm so well, I'm excited for you. You never know what's going to happen. You know, I'll probably be. Yeah. I'm still single. I'm still single. Period. Guys. Just Period. dating around. I'm yeah. still I'm talking to people, I'm living my fun. life. I'm a bartender, guys. You know, yeah, I got to talk to everybody every day. Period. Make some conversation, Period. you know, I want to talk about um, your dating life and like tips that you would give people because um you know i've been with raul for like literally like 10 years as of this year and we've been like married i haven't dated around in a long ass time like those tinder apps and all those like the the apps that i have to do with dating i didn't know about them until i was already like with raul so like i never got to use them Mm -hmm. what is that like like the whole like online dating and just like what is the dating life for you first of all first of all what year did you guys get married both like Oh, 2007. I mean, no, no, no. no. What the you? fuck? 2017, I, I was 23. I got married three years ago. You were? I was married at 25. Okay. Dang, like 23. 23. That's what oh, we're that's talking about on the other podcast. The other podcast, we're talking about ages. Like how, like, when you hit a certain age, you're like, wait, I'm not, like, as old as I thought I was. Especially now looking back at 23, bitch. Like, I was not, like, like I was more than ready to get married because I was with Brian for so many years. But, like. I was young, like 23, bitch. That's a kid. Not that young. But, but it sounds it. like, it does sound like someone really it. young. 23? I was 25. Yeah. You're early 20s, bitch. That's crazy. Well, I'm 25, single and thriving. I and fucking love it. And I'm I love it. it. I'm here for it. Just um, have a blast. Like, yeah. don't be shy. That's the thing, too. Like, it's Period. it's you get in your shy girl phase and you're just like, oop, like, I don't know how to talk. <laughs> but, like, all these all these people like, like, confident girls confident people like yeah, you know just like what is it uh big bitch energy energy like just he give just it watches. like you know love like it. you just gotta serve like every time be like yeah <laughs> i ate that for me like dating even going out to the bar like girl wink a little bit like Period. make them buy you a drink yeah, like say, don't be ashamed you know i was gonna say for us out there that might not be the most confident queens yeah what would you say to them what would you say like what, what, what kind of with, advice hi. <laughs> yeah yeah someone that's like and then shy give it up for sugar someone that's <laughs> <laughs> someone that's shy that might like somebody how do they make the first move oh girl don't ever let's make the let's first make the move. scenario let's make the scenario <laughs> i'm shy right i'm at the bar and i'm just looking at you and i think you're so cute but i'm so shy tell me so you catch me looking at wait no no now i gotta pretend like i'm the guy because you're the girl that's shy mm-hmm. what's that what's good no i'm the i'm, the, good, I'm the guy because you're gonna tell us oh. how to be the girl so i'm oh, like what's up bad. you're gonna tell I'm us the like, guy how to confront someone so you're shy okay. you're shy okay. i'm the shy one fragile <laughs> fragile not my delicate little mouth <laughs> but i'm the guy like so what's up <laughs> and you're shy okay, okay. <laughs> remember you're shy should i just run away like or i'm just looking no. at you like run away mm-hmm, like mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm Taste just looking drink. at you with my drink, but you're so shy, and I'm not gonna make the first move. <laughs> Should I wink? Peter, like, just wink. Like, I'm winking. I don't know. Like, from then, so oh, you also, to, you also have to just, just look up and down. Look, look at their face. Just look at their Ma'am, face. Your back like, twitching. <laughs> Ma'am, are you having a seizure? <laughs> oh my god. Um, I don't know. <laughs> something okay with her okay so, but like like i'm chilling i'm not even noticing you winking because i'm minding my business at the bar like oh my god <laughs> so you, you gotta say something <laughs> <Hi. laughs> Oh my god! Nobody, 
<laughs> nobody on this earth makes me laugh as much as Peter does. Yeah, for real. Like that ass. Oh my god. So okay. Bad. So well, yeah, like, okay. <laughs> Let's start again. Imagine action. <laughs> just kidding. Re- okay, guys, that was just the, the replay. <laughs> that was just the warm up. <laughs> yeah, bloopers. Uh, but like, okay, like what? what okay, yeah, like. <laughs> well, you gotta make the first move, girl. That's why, like, <laughs> you're playing. That's why I'm saying you. You're playing the shy girl. Like, you're gonna wink. Okay, you're gonna no, say come hi. Here he's, often. Saying, <laughs> he's saying that you don't make the first move, right? Is what you're saying? No, nah, don't make the first move. Don't don't say hi. Okay, don't, okay, okay. So I'm just the guy. Let them come. Hey, in. girl, you're looking kind of cute there. Um, thanks, papi. <laughs> Girl, she got you know, I mean, at this point, at this eight time in Asia, just yeah. just go off. Just be like, okay, what so else what you got to I lose? After. Uh-huh. What else you got to lose? So what you doing in this bar, girl? <laughs> I'm alone. <laughs> Waiting for my You're friends. looking for some company? Girl. Like, so, I'm like, first of all, I don't know how to fucking play. We're role playing up in You're here. looking for some company. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh! So we're lonely tonight too. Okay, that's a different story, girl. If you're lonely, just go straight at them. So you would They're say lonely like, too. so you would say someone shy, obviously, still not make the first move, but once they start talking, mm-hmm. just mm-hmm. go full force. Period. <laughs> I think just don't have any high expectations. There's a lot of people. Oh my god, there's so many people where I go out to people and they'll be like, "The love of your life might be in this room," and I and I always put in their head. They're not in this room. Period. <laughs> they are not standing in the building right now. I hope they are somewhere thriving without me. Queen. Just <laughs> because they are not right here right now. Okay, oh period. God. Um. So you are, you don't make the first move then, right? Not ever. Not usually. Period. Which sucks. Which sucks Do you play me. hard to get? <sighs> yeah. Peter's a I tease. I feel like I, I like that, Peter's though. a tease. I like Peter's that. Peter's a huge tease. I love that. Yeah. It's iconic. Hmm. Okay. You gotta give them crumbs. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. So you gotta give them crumbs, crumbs before they have the full. The cake. thing about me too, if you're dating Peter, you're not gonna get the whole fantasy at once. Like you're gonna get it little by little. Like Her. you're gonna want to ask for more. Yeah. Like you're not gonna. No, I'm not gonna go fresh <laughs> face to the movies. Like yeah. girl, absolutely not. Like disgusting. Okay. <laughs> what? So Why disgusting? On? Who goes to the beat with the face to the movies? Um. We do. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, do. never mind. The three of us oh, have yeah, it. Actually, yeah, I, I go too, too. Oh, never yeah, mind. I'm talking at. I'm just talking. <laughs> okay. I don't want to go to the movies the, my first time, though. Like, the yeah. first oh, day. Like the, you want to be, yeah, like the first time. Maybe, like, yeah, like, after a while when I'm comfortable. Like, okay, guys. Okay, you guys know that. the fantasy at this is point. Is there, like, a, is there a certain, like, um, like, phrase you use when you flirt? Like, are you ever cheesy like that? Like. Just yeah, little phrases. Yeah, like a little like like a little thing you say. Mm. Like, like what's like, your go to? Like yeah, this will get him. This will trap him. This will uh, trap him. <laughs> this is it. This is the go to one. Uh, <laughs> He's like, I just gotta pull my pants to show this. No, imagine. imagine. No, I'll cakey. Uh, um, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> No, I wish. What, is there like a trick? Like, I no, wish like, there was a you know trick. how you hear there's like little like phrases? Like, I don't yeah. know. I'm like, this Peter have like a little phrase. Girl, just wear good perfume. <laughs> Period. Period. Is, that, is that the trap? I think that's like the, like, if you wear a good <laughs> perfume, I think people are just naturally going to be like, mm, you smell yeah, good. Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. And then it's just like, ooh, okay. That part. Period. I think just smell good. That, that would be a good, good yeah, little Yeah, because like, people smell bad. <laughs> oh my God. So, have you ever had somebody like that? that, like, have Girl. like, I've that yeah, hiking. you've gone to the bar and people just smell like straight up bo, like they just have not showered. And I'm just sometimes like, I'm like, <gasps> please do not stand, next girl. Time. You need a man. To you. Yeah, <laughs> some people will be talking to you, and you're just like, here's a Mentos. Have you ever been with somebody that like truly like stank? Mm. Where you're like, I'm here for a good time, not a long time, because that fucking ass is. <laughs> oh, like in general, if I like, I just hooked up with someone. Who like, smelled. if you hooked up with yes. somebody and you're yes. like, they're cute, but they no, stink. I had to like literally like there was a point where I literally unbuckled their pants and it just like just a whiff, and I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go. Close <laughs> the fucking door. Zip. <laughs> bitch. Zip. Not the green bubble around Girl. this man. And <laughs> naturally, like, I feel like every body area just naturally smells, but just that yeah, area course. alone just has like a specific scent. And I just like, <laughs> it was just a lot of that scent. <laughs> balls. Oh my God. Balls. Just straight balls. Like, yeah, <laughs> Holy straight shit. Up. Yeah, it was we salty. Love you could, boil. You could <laughs> smell it, salty, sweet, everything, girl. It's smacking the, the face. I was like, boil. I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god that's 
so you knew it was Peter's bedtime. Oh my god, this is a, actually a really good story too. I think you did mention it in a video, right? Which so which one? No. Let's Back talk about it. Bring it, it. Bring it. We need a video about it. Bring it about y'all are doing, you are asking too many questions. <laughs> no, We've done a lot of personal videos. Channel, what are we talking about? Are you talking about the time where I, where my grandma walked in on me? Yeah, yeah. Oh my god! Wait, I think wait, wait, you wait. did a video about that. Though. I did. Yeah, I did yeah. do a video, but it's gone. I think it's gone now. It's somewhere in the archives. But, <laughs> but me. there was this one time where I was freshly on Tinder. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> she was thriving. Period. Oh my god! I guys. thought I had the house to myself, <laughs> <laughs> and basically, my grandma comes in from the swap meet to like me. Oh. Yeah, girl, like. Getting her ass, her cheeks clapped. Period. Like, <laughs> oh my god, dude! Didn't you say you were like gripped onto the headboard and it was like, I, like <laughs> girl, I did the whole girl. It was a whole. Why are you thing. bringing yeah. up all the details? She's, she's not going in depth. <laughs> we tried to picture the scene. Well, yeah, she, she's trying to really paint the setting. <laughs> okay, think of an iron bed. <laughs> <laughs> an iron wooden bed and then old skinny Peter Red. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hanging on for dear life. He's like cheeks open and off. And there's this like a six foot two baseball player behind stop. him. <laughs> <Please> stop, stop. <laughs> and then a sweet old lady with her car of nopales walks in. No! <laughs> No. Oh, oh my shit. God. Oh my god. Wait, so like what happened? Like we act like I don't know the story. <laughs> Girl, you know everything. But, um, <laughs> what did happen after that? Like oh I mean my. I think she she screamed. I remember she screamed. Like she literally screamed and oh then like she just goodness. closed the door and then she said my real name and then yeah, girl. Like, oh my Pedro. God. Yeah, not Pedro. <laughs> Pedro. Like yeah. <laughs> Girl, it was no, bad. No. It was so oh embarrassing. God. Ever since then, I don't think I've ever brought another man to the house. Ever, <laughs> the question is, ever. did you keep going or did you guys just fire no, we, st- it? we stopped, girl. We were like, we gotta go. <laughs> we gotta stop this. <laughs> I think she like, yeah, girl. He left. Like, oh, it was it was bad. I literally like. It was funny. At the, it was funny. Like, <laughs> I still think it's funny, but it, it's just traumatizing. That poor lady. She probably doesn't. Even, I does she remember? <laughs> I hope she doesn't remember. Did she ever bring it up to you <laughs> after? No, no, she never That's brought it up again. That's even more awkward, yeah, dude. Like, yeah. fuck. Yeah, but, like, how do you bring something like that? I know, I know. I remember At dinner, time Sophia, too, like, earlier. Obviously, like, I was, like, 16, like, doing all that shit. But mm-hmm. she was even like, I'm going to tell your mom. Like, what is it to my mom? And I'm like, not my mom. You know, like, oh, what did the guy say? Mom. He was just laughing. Like, it was just funny. Well, he doesn't live there. Why would he care? Yeah. <gasps> so oh. his life isn't fucked. You just came to fuck, like. Oh my god. You didn't care. That's the oh thing too. Like god. when whenever you get in trouble or like whenever you like it's I don't know. Have you have you guys ever been in a situation where you go to a friend's house and they're being yelled at? Like yeah. and then yeah. you're just sitting there on the couch awkward, like I'm like, girl, should I just step out? Like Yeah, like what's going on? Like, like she could about to get up a smacker. Yeah. Like, oh my god. Have you guys seen that TikTok where like you're like pretending like your mom's like screaming on the phone and you're like, yeah, like uh-huh. And you're just like screaming, but you don't want your friends to know. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, love you. She's like screaming at you. <laughs> Hello, it's Kitty. Uh, <laughs> girl, I'm dead. I'm so fucking true. Peter has like some crazy ass stories. I feel There's, like if you need to start doing story, I know you're you've done story times, but like I feel I feel like you have so many. There are so do. many. That was the thing too. I remember that that was my that was my whole little. Yeah. Persona. By the way, guys, everything we talked about here, like he already did like I story did, times I've on it. Like open. I wouldn't just she like does. put him she on does. the spot like that. Like he's done videos on this already. She never went viral. Period. <laughs> <laughs> no, so stop. it's okay. Damn. I want to talk about going Garcia because every single day people are like, "When is there another season?" <laughs> He, y'all actually really liked it. Like yeah, they, liked it. they were. Sh- I was shook. I was shook that they actually liked People it. People ask every single day, huh? Yeah, like every day. And what do you guys think? Do you guys think we would do it again? Or I hope we would I one day. I think we should. I hope yeah. one day we would. I think it could be planned it was better. So but I do iconic. think that. Yeah, it was such a beautiful concept, and it was. I think that I the wish the episodes were longer. Production. The wasn't videos were short. It. Yeah, like and the, the team was cool. Yeah. Everything. Everything was cool. It just wasn't put together how we thought yeah like there was little situations where it was like okay let's do this and then our feelings got way too involved in it where it was like damn this shit could have just been like scripted as fuck like you know what i mean like you know the kardashians are scripted girl you know every single fight is scripted i know that it was so different but didn't we have we would have had the little scandal fight moment 
like Didn't better have, and like, planned it out. It would have been what just was our, so much um, better. What was our um, secret code? Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. And when we said peanut butter, that meant like eat me out. I mean, no, 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 no. I'm oh, sorry. No, 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 no. No. Oh, we're I that mean, kind like, of family. Yeah. No, I mean like. <laughs> oh, I mean like <laughs> like peanut butter was like chew me out. Like go ahead. Like yeah, like, like we knew like, like 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 okay like like eat me out. Like well, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like like peanut butter was like okay. We know we know like. It's about to go down. Like, don't take it personal. Uh-huh, peanut butter. Uh-huh. Peanut butter, yeah. we're about to fight. Yeah. We're about to fight. And it's just Eat me out. Around. Bitch, like, what? Yeah. I meant chew me out. Like, what does that even fucking oh mean? My God. Read me. <laughs> like, right. Read me, in other words. But I think if we were to do it again, it scripted, yeah. there's, like, certain things that I'm like, okay, I want it to be more, like, not so scripted. Yeah. Like, like didn't we film I the wish, whole season in, like, a couple weeks? In, like, like, in a, a month. Week? It like, in a week. It was all filmed in a month. Like, I wish your was parents would have came out. I would wanted to have to have their own episode. Like, that would have been beautiful. Like, my parents be more involved. Yeah. Huh? Like, it, like, yeah. And then it was just so they fast. Were short. Like, it was so fast. I wish that the confessionals were more, like, elegant. Like, not right after. Not the confession. Right not after, after all us hiking. Sweating, not hiking. Tired. Fucking doing the, the, the yeah. camping in the backyard all sweaty and sticky <laughs> as shit. Like... After I doing the paintballs, like, like girl, yeah. like why, like I, I think like we've learned a lot from that season. I'm like, okay, no, like it, I think it should be more like raw, more like and have set days know. aside to do the interviews, yeah. like where yeah. we're like like very like housewife energy, like yes. fucking be to the gods, yeah. like that's the goal. I was gonna come in here that. and be like, welcome back to the reunion, like. <laughs> I thought we were gonna have a fucking reunion. We asked okay. for a reunion, can but we, we didn't some, get one. Can we get some real tea? I was gonna say that. They were like, we're gonna give you guys a reunion. Like, don't even worry. You guys have like all this like fan base coming on. Like, you guys are strong. The like, show did pretty well. Yeah, they, they offered us did, a lot. I remember when they talked about us in that one, like when we filmed our other, when we filmed that whole there was a whole other thing that we filmed for them, like it those little clips and stuff trailer, like that. Right? Yeah, it was yeah. The, the the sizzle to like pitch to to the pitch to yeah the when we were there well we were talking to a bunch of people and they were excited for us we were excited for them and they were like we're we gonna throw a do reunion. it again we gotta do a reunion like this is we iconic. gotta do it again just better yeah yes like, like i think we learned from it like we have to do it again yeah just longer better. episodes and real like shit like us like not real having shit. to plan like yeah. real yeah. shit where it's like okay follow me along the day like yeah. very like because like didn't we have like the christmas party and then like like we were doing multiple episodes in one day. Girl, it we were doing the Christmas party in October. Like it yeah. was Halloween, and we that were throwing Christmas, Christmas party. That Christmas party, Peter, was iconic. It was so much fun. I was actually the other day so watching iconic. the older episodes, and I'm like, this shit is fucking up. hilarious. It was iconic. I it was don't. So iconic. Yeah, like it was iconic. Period. I was yeah. watching the one where I had my photo shoot. And it's so funny because like Peter was supposed to be like my stylist and stuff. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Like, I'm like, he's never been my stylist. Girl, that was such I'm a, telling that you. was like so scripted. So scripted. Yeah, yeah. Like everything like, so, scripted. A lot or like how me and Peter but... were like having wine, like fucking around. I'm like, we're never at her photo shoots. Like, yeah, why are we like, doing why this? are we even here? Like, like you're not even part of Crab City. Like, yeah, like, like, we're not even part of the team. Shoot. Like what's We this? were like, we went on tour. Like, why? Like, we're not even part I wasn't even part of Slime Mania. Oh my god, speaking of Slime Mania, we were, we were the the what do you Call them? You guys were the the MCs, for MCs, Slimania. bitch. So you could you so could you tell that? me I'm on tour. Ah, you guys I, were, so we I did were go on tour. On tour. We were, were the MCs. The shows. Me and Peter, you guys would go on stage, like the stage right of it all. I don't know how the fuck we would do it, but we would. Mm-hmm. We would, girl. We would. We didn't even. We'd like practice. Like, we would try. A, uh, they would it would never go as planned, though. It ever, would never. Ever. Do you remember like the night? Uh, the night before, Luis even asked us, "What are you guys gonna say?" And yeah, we yeah. even like tried practicing in front yeah, of the yeah, beds yeah, and everything. Yeah. And we were like just looking at each other, just laughing. We definitely and we had were, like, some awkward We can't do moments. this. We can't do this. Um, I remember it was just so awkward at the point where we were like, give it up for sugar. Peter was saying, yeah, we would like obviously try to hype up the crowd. This is when like we were not. This is just like when I don't know what the fuck was going on. It's Slimania. What were we hyping up? But Slime yeah, I, I I heard Peter be like, give it up for sugar. And people would just like Whoo. scream. Like people were and just I'm like, screaming, throwing shit. Like just, and, <laughs> but like, it didn't matter. Peter I would be like, like blue. I remember, I remember we were interviewing, crazy. I remember we were interviewing Honey Boo Boo. Oh Honey God. Boo Boo Child. No, y'all. that was in Atlanta. That was Honey in Atlanta. I'm boo-boo. talking about the one, the one in, um, no, the one that you asked her for a favorite, her, for her favorite color. Wasn't that Honey Boo Boo? Hold on. Oh, yeah, Honey, and I remember thinking like, okay, this is like, 
like legit we're interviewing like someone and like, i told y'all don't iconic. embarrass me no honey motherfucking but with child from toddlers and tiaras is gonna be here and you guys better have some good questions <laughs> for her like you know about how the show's going and stuff what's and y'all ask color? what's your favorite color <laughs> that was Peter. that was Peter. And then you guys asked, like, what's your favorite candy? Like, the dumbest questions. I was and like, that, I think that's what I was like. That's what Peter was like, give it up for sugar. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And the crowd goes crazy. And the kids were going wild. The kids who were does, eating it up. Who does not love sugar? So they were going crazy. <laughs> but I'm thinking, like, the questions, bitch. No, no but I'm thinking about, no, it was fun. I feel like You guys were entertaining. Sometimes, like, we would get awkward on stage, but we would play it off really well. If Peter, yeah. like, stopped talking, I knew. I'm like, okay, I gotta, I gotta take over. Or, like, if I was, like, he would feel it and he would take over, too. Mm-hmm. But I do remember this one time, and it was probably, like, one second, but, like, I felt this shit in my soul. I was like, this is awkward silence. In Dallas. <laughs> yeah, was yeah, it in yeah. Dallas? <laughs> <laughs> I was just like, no, I think, <laughs> I don't know if I was talking I or you were talking, <laughs> but then. It was like that awkward stare, like say something. Was, I know, I remember that. I remember that. Like it was just like I, I wasn't saying anything, and you're just looking at me. And you know, Peter, I like laugh. <laughs> you were like, you just like laughed, and I was thinking, like, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Like I feel like he kind of was like, like you tried to like, like break the awkwardness by laughing, but like there was still nothing yeah, after. Yeah. I was like. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm I was dead. like, oh my god. There was, it was just such a ma- we were a mess, but we were such a good but time. We were too. no, but like we, we were like, there's we were, a bull. Yeah, <laughs> we were like, we had our awkward moments, but I feel like we were good for not ever fucking like. We were literally on stage, y'all, in front of hundreds of kids, fucking like straight up, like holding. We held Slimania down. Oh my gosh, yeah, do you guys yeah. remember? Well, we were recording Goring Garcia through that whole thing. Yeah, yeah. And they were like, guys, we need to get a clip of you guys getting ready, and like you guys. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. I oh, walked yeah, yeah, out yeah, yeah. with full butter face. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. Not even blending. Like foundation just smear. Just <laughs> yeah, smear. Yeah. Like, when the vendors were setting up, right? Like and they trend. made Peter. <laughs> so we were, we were saying hi to all the vendors. Yeah, 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 yeah. The production was like, you guys need to go. We need to get footage of you guys walking around. You guys saying saying hi, hi to everybody. But Peter was getting ready. And you know when you just like put your foundation on and your lips are covered, your brows are covered, like everything just <laughs> butter face, girl. And they're like, we got to go. We got to go. So Peter's like... <laughs> Do I even like blend at the time? So like, somebody I'm, put up a picture. I'm meeting people like like full. Oh my the god! Picture, picture. Just full somebody like butterface. Who's like, page? Who posted it? We'll post I think it, it was right Joseph here. Anthony. We'll put it up. Oh my right god! Now. I thought to find it at the. We're about to put it up right here. You guys, it was just so funny because Peter was like, oh, shit, okay, I don't have an option. So we just all run out and Peter's like, his makeup's not even done. He just has foundation all over him. It was so funny. It was all bad. And I'm just there like taking, and there was that's the only picture that I remember getting. That we were just like, oh god! No, but it's just funny, like, did you I, find it? I'm trying. Hold on. Oh my god! But going oh, Garcia, that shit was funny. Going Garcia, although like I wish it was longer, and I wish they like, you know, it was a better job. It doesn't look it bad. It was so fun. It was a blast. I would have bad. not bad, taken either. it back. Look. Oh, it's. No. Oh my god! Wasn't that the night that somebody was, asked if you were like Chris Jenner or something? Yes, they were. Like, oh yes. Or they, what did they ask? Still, they said Karina's mom's really pretty. Oh yeah. Yeah. No, this was a real story. One of my friends, her yeah. mom was watching her stories and she kept texting her like, oh my God, Karina's mom is, I don't know what she's like said. And that she said that Karina's mom was really pretty. And then she was like, what are you talking about? And she was talking about Peter because he would come out of my stories. <laughs> <laughs> and obviously she was like, that's not Peter's mom. That's not Karina's mom. But, but then oh she was God. just complimenting. Like, but like, you know, some you ladies do have like short hair. Yeah. A little Chris Jenner moment. <laughs> No, you're, you're, you're going to take another one? I think I am going to take Here another one. as you fucking should. Might as well. We got them for Might a Might as fucking well. I do want to tell the audience, though, that behind the scenes, we really Peter's do like want that to you're, do... He's not my mom. Imagine, like, what? <laughs> Peter's this not my mom. This is not my mother. Uh, <laughs> um, but we really are, like, thinking about doing another season. We you know, have talked about it. Um, really? But differently. Like, we're thinking about, Peter like, doing it on our own terms. You the other day, right? You didn't see that, that group chat? In the group chat. We started this group chat. We started a group chat the other day. It's not even you started. Guys have it's the old, old number. Is that what it is? We didn't even start the group chat. No. It was an old group chat. Mm. It was an old group chat. Okay. Well, we need no, to make a new one. I text you all the time to your your current number. Oh wait, no, yeah, you guys have my new number. Wait, wait I'm stupid. The the group chat that we like reignited again. That was like the old one. So I'm sure that's your old number in there. Mm-hmm. That's true. But we we're thinking about it. Yeah, we want to do like <sighs> yeah. with our own production and stuff. Oh my god, 
totally down that would be so iconic that would be so iconic just everything like its own little like thing yeah yeah it would have to be a different name huh i think because we had like for sure because it was like like trademark they own they own the name i mean girly if you think about it we were iconic we went to we were on times square the fact that we had yeah a billboard we weren't in Times there. Square. The fact that for real Fucking we didn't get billboard. on the flight, but the fact that we they wanted did. to go visit to see our billboard, but we never did. But somebody took a picture, and it was just so surreal. We were literally like on one of the biggest fucking billboards in Times Square. In Times Square, like if you stood Insane. in Times Square, you would have seen it. Like that's crazy. That's mind bottling. Crazy. That's crazy. Mm-hmm. Crazy. It was. It was we done some time. iconic things. Let's do it again, like for sure, you guys. Yeah. We will try our best. Another hi- iconic thing is Hocus Pocus. <gasps> oh, Hocus Pocus. Hocus, Hocus, bitch. Hocus Pocus is coming up, y'all. That was iconic. I think it comes out. Oh, wait. <laughs> they were talking about the movie. The well, both. Yeah. The, they're well, having, did, a, they're yeah. having a sequel. The, yeah, the, that movie that's coming out. I'm excited because I'm a Hocus Pocus fanatic. But we did dress up as Hocus Pocus that one mm-hmm. year. And we literally won um, a costume contest in LA. We, yeah. Did. we, did. Yeah, yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. That was iconic. That was iconic. That was fun. It- we had to do something this year. Like the three <laughs> of us again. Mm-hmm. We should Little do powder it. puff moment. I love or it. Or something like... What, what could be our, our costume that we something could do like, for Something more three? iconic. Like, yeah, I feel like that's wag. Hocus Pocus was Hocus so Pocus was freaking was bomb. so iconic. Nothing, it was just so bomb. Nothing will beat that. What could be like a little three... Comment down Halloween below, town. guys. Uh, what's Halloween? a good Halloween town? I'm gonna be the grandma. Ah, period. Comment down below, guys. What's like a good threesome? Like, uh, no, threesome. Not like a, no, what's a good threesome? No, a threesome costume. Yes. Oh, a tri- a triplet costume. He's like, like, like oh, so we role playing. Watching. Imagine, like, wait. Uh, uh, yeah. What would be a good costume? Okay, so I think we should play unpopular opinions or like hot takes, which is usually an unpopular opinion. opinion yeah, right? they're not popular unpopular opinions where, you know, we have a list that our producer puts together for us and these are unpopular opinions that we could agree with or disagree with. Okay, I'm down. I, 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 this is fun. We like to have like little games on the podcast. Period. Yeah. Okay. So, ooh, I actually okay. The first opinion, unpopular. <laughs> In and out isn't the best. I don't like it and out. I think it's good, but it's not too good. Yeah. Uh, I think it's like good for Cali, but like if you, yeah, it's not that. It's like yeah, outside wow. of Cali, it's not that good. I, I'm shocked. Does that make that sense? Me. I feel like I'm the only one. Like my friends, when I tell them, they're shocked. Like, no, because do I don't like even it? like their fries. I'm not a huge fan of their fries. They got me on the fries part. Like if their fries were yeah. perfect. Uh, and they're actually, um, they're. They're potatoes. <laughs> they are potato. Arm no, fries potatoes, arm fries girl. Potatoes. But they're actually like freshly made right there. Yeah. They're not frozen. Mm. But So that's why they might taste a little more stiff. But they are. I think they're so good. But I don't think their burgers are that great. I don't think their burgers are that great. I don't they're, think they're, they're delicious. Right. They're, they're good. Sauce. <laughs> like, they're sauce. I love like, their sauce. The sauce is good. And yeah. any little, and also like they have the little tiny, chal- how, <laughs> the little spicy. Jalapeno? Yeah. yeah. The yeah. yellow peppers? Oh, mm-hmm. yellow peppers. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know. It's I, all right. I, I don't see the hype. Sometimes it's yeah. a vibe, but I don't think it's I'll the best. I'll eat it, but, you know. Okay, next unpopular opinion. Bad Bunny isn't hot. <gasps> I don't think he's like, wow. Oh. I think he's I'm hot. Gonna, I'm going to like, like insult him. the Bad Bunny community. Something about. It's just a preference. Something about Papi right Yeah, there. he's not <laughs> ugly. He's handsome, but he's not I like, think- I guess, what people <laughs> make him seem like. I feel like I don't know. Like I understand. Like I, she, he, like I could say what well, people think he's cute, but because I'm not like a diehard fan, like I guess like that's why I don't see like I guess the like I'm not like obsessed with yeah, him. Yeah, maybe because I'm a but, fan. I'm a fan, so like I might see him as really bomb, attractive. Yeah, that's true. But like someone who isn't a fan, and like I could see that. Yeah. Mm, yeah. He's, I mean, he's cute. Yeah. I just I'm not like obsessed with him like that. I I'm guess. not. A, oh, girl. No, he's bomb. To me, he's a ten. Period. Are we saying? Oh, Sorry, <laughs> well, you think you think that Edwin is like the cutest guy ever, and he's low key a little average. Something like Edwin to me is a three girl. To me, I'm like okay. He's not. But Bad Bunny is a cute. ten. Like okay, Period. I need to I need to get it together. I get. <laughs> I, I don't think like, Edwin's like that cute anymore. Like you, that. Yeah, I actually feel like I couldn't. I think Bad Bunny's way cuter than Edwin. <laughs> like hands down, but it's different preferences for everybody. True. And you're also a diehard for Edwin, so. And I, I'm a just huge fan of Grupo Firme, so it could be that too that I'm like a huge fan. Mm-hmm. 
Um, cold pizza is better than hot pizza. I like hot pizza. Me too. It's still a little buzzing though, cold. I think, yeah, I like hot, but sometimes it's just a vibe to just take a cold pizza. Okay. I can but feel like that's a vibe, but like there's nothing fresh hot. in a really hot, sizzling, fat slice. Costco <laughs> pizza. Costco yeah, pizza is buzzing too. That's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> we should have pizza after this, y'all. Should we go somewhere? Oh my God. Wait, I bought Down. some, I bought Costco recently. I bought like these like noodles that come with like dumplings and soup dumplings inside the noodles. Bitch, about to have a Ooh. fucking big bong after this. Okay. Like, and they're like shrimp dumplings. Not we should get some, thing. y'all. You know, you know Costco's bomb. I got some Moshi, Moshi ice cream in the fridge. Okay, period. Chef Korean, yeah. go off. I feel like these I got after wings. now, let's do rapid fire, y'all. We've been talking for an hour and a half. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's okay. a lot. We need you to come back as a permanent guest. Ah! <laughs> Become the co-host. Not the special guest. You should, Peter. You guys comment down below. Um, okay. He has to come back. Most women are bad drivers. So would you say that's an unpopular opinion? I mean, it's definitely like an unpopular opinion. That's opinion, very but. untrue. I know I have a lot of female female driving I mean, friends who like are I really good drivers. I am a horrible driver <laughs> myself. Okay. But. That's just me, you know. I just want to. I just want to stand up for my female community. I think that's a lie. Period. Period. Money can buy happiness. No. No. Money can't buy health. No. I don't and think, I think, think so. That's more important. That part. That part. Didn't Chloe say? I think you could buy a new car, which it is going to buy you shit that's going to make you happy. But like mirror to list. Mirror, like, what is I it? mean, mirror that's, ni- it's cute. It's it's all right to say like uh, to an extent. Like fucking Chloe Kardashian said, I know that money. She's like, or was it Kylie? She's like. Yeah, it does. Like, <laughs> did you say that shit? <laughs> right? I, did I mean, Kylie say that? A billion dollars. I mean, maybe. Kylie billionaire Jenner. No, like, of course, that. like, like you know, you rather be like broke and sad or happy and depressed. Like, why? No, that's what? terrible. Just, I'd rather just on. be. I don't know what the saying was. Not that I agree with it hundred percent, but like. You know, I know what you're saying. Not having the money to maybe pay your mortgage, pay your rent. There's that saying to have food over your head. That might cause a little bit of fucking depression. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So it just depends. Like it. But Karina said it. Money cannot buy health. Period. Um, Androids are better than iPhone. That's. (laughs) (laughs) Sorry, I had to cackle a little bit. Sorry, that was the that was a little Android megabits. Um, definitely unpopular. And just say I'm unpopular. I don't know. I'm an Apple gang, so I I just you know whatever floats your boat, girl. Um, the sex doesn't have to last long. <laughs> it doesn't, right? I mean, what do you guys? Think? It doesn't have. Sometimes do think, it be Peter? lasting a little too long. Yeah, that. What part. do you think, Peter? Actually, yeah. yeah, that part. Sometimes when it's good, it's good, and you're good. Like, sometimes I'm like boom. just a little quickie. Part, yeah, right? love it. <laughs> On with the day. <laughs> Yeah, like if you're you got having, things like, to do, unless like you're trying to just have yeah. a moment. Yeah, then, okay. if, if you're trying to have a good moment and like you he the finishes moment. like in three fucking seconds, like of course it's like, well, you fucking ruined yeah, it. Like we didn't yeah. even, you know. But even a long moment for me, like it better not be more than half an hour. Like, oh, you're pushing. Like, oh, you're imagine? pushing. Oh, girl, you better like, put on the Titanic. Are, like, Might as well. <laughs> <laughs> There's people that'll be like, oh, yeah, I want to do it all night long. And I'm like, who got the time? Who, Who got the, the time? Fuck? Girl, my back's gonna hurt. Right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm tired. Yeah, I'm tired. that part. <laughs> that part. She's clocked out. Uh, bye. Like, okay. come on. Dogs shouldn't sleep in your bed. I'm sorry, my uh, dog is sleeping on my bed with me. Unless like they got fleas and you gotta fix that. Yeah, if then, you have okay. fleas okay. and you're getting bit the fuck up, yes. <laughs> yes, but but my dogs are my babies. Yeah, that baby needs me. a home too. She wants to be comfortable. <laughs> Period. <laughs> Beer doesn't actually taste good. It don't. It don't. I don't girl. think it does. It don't taste no I, good. I, I don't think any alcohol tastes good. Mm-mm. Period. Like <laughs> actually, yeah. unpopular opinion. I think nineteen forty two is gross. It gave me the worst it is. hangover ever. Yeah? The I worst. I forget how it tastes. It's kind of bad, yeah. They're all terrible to You me. introduced me to Casamigos. That's bomb. I love Casamigos. I like it. Casamigos is bomb. Shout out to Casamigos. Night. What kind of host are we? We should have had a Casamigos bottle. I should have brought one. Period. Oh, we should. No, we should have had it for you. You're the guest. Edibles. Peter's the one over here bringing the edibles. Period. <laughs> period. The okay. Supplier. Night showers are better than morning showers. They make me sleep good. Hell yeah. 
all nice and comfy in the bed. I'm do sorry. You, are that are that you part? guys with that rule with like you have to be clean to go in your bed, or do you guys get in with like your clothes that you wore? I think you have to be clean to go in your bed, like fresh PJs on. Oof, the best. Oh, sometimes I'd be laying with like the shit I wore out. No, Raul will be like, you need to change. We were out and took all these steps. I think that's no fucking way. Yeah, it's not like I think it's just naturally just going to sleep clean and waking up refreshed. Oh, like, 100%. I think that's but just, like if you, I think that's if you were going to take a nap during the day, because some of the people are oh, super like, that's different. Like very like germophobics about that. Mm-hmm. Like they'll be like, you cannot come in with like the clothes you wore out. Like what happens if you want to take a nap? Do you change? Raul's more about like wow. the shoes and like the pants. He, yeah, he'll be like, you need to change. Okay. Posting too many stories is annoying. Is that an unpopular opinion? Like when there's fucking dots, the stories look like dots. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, bitch, next. Oh my God. No, I, I, I honestly, if it's yeah. ever too long and I'm really not intrigued. No, even even you guys, your guys' selves, when you guys are posting story, stories, you know when there's too many already, right? Yeah. Like, do you guys ever just stop? Like, okay, this is becoming I, a lot. I I'll delete them. I delete. Yeah, delete, I'm delete, like, this delete. is, like, overwhelming. And then they don't even perform that well if they're, like, too many because nobody's fucking watching them. They're over you? They're just, like, Yeah, like, who they're wants to go? Swiping, we got it. You're crying. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, quote signs as, as home decor are cringy. A little live, laugh, laugh moment. I love those. I'm sorry. I have so many cheesy ones around my house. Period. So many. It's like, so I love cute. I love something. I love this. But what I love the most is help with the dishes or something like this. Oh, Remember yeah, that, that was so cute. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. Those, those like are so ones. fucking cute. They're I think they're funny. House. They're very funny. I think they're really cute. Yeah. Like, especially like a... A positive one, like I would like to see a positive quote when I wake up in the morning. Like, yeah. what's wrong with that? You know? Okay, it's okay to date your friend's ex if you ask first. <laughs> what kind of girl code is shit? I'm sorry, it ain't happening. I think we all watched Maddie and Cassie go through it, <laughs> so we know to not to date never. your friend's ex. Like, no, that's girl that's code. That's just limits. girl code. Like, you don't want to do that. Uh, girl. That's, that's like wearing the same diaper after, like. <laughs> You gonna sit in the same shit. <laughs> Over. Period. Okay, staying in is better than going out. Sometimes, bitch. Some, sometimes it's fifty fifty, girl. Like, fifty fifty. There are times where you want to go out and have a good night, and there are times where you just want to stay inside and drink a white claw. Like, yeah, yeah. Dead ass, period. Yeah. So that was it for our unpopular opinions. Peter, did you have a blast today? <sighs> I absolutely loved Chins and Giggles. This was oh, a fun time for sure. You have sure. to come back. I you hope so. To, one day. Have to. One day. I know they're yes. going to love this episode. They're going to request it. Comment down below. Oh, my bad. <laughs> <Yes, Mike's laughs> we need to have you back. Okay. Are you guys high as fuck? I'm honestly, fi- um, like, I'm pretty good. I'm like, it's because these are like legal. So you're not supposed to really feel like a crazy dosage off them. How so you guys are like feeling good. good yeah, I'm feeling I've been more feeling chill. Relaxed. Giggly. I'm very giggly for yeah. sure. I feel like it, ha- it helped me just have like a such a relaxed episode. Like so relaxed. Oh, so oh, relaxed. Period. Mm-hmm. You have to come back. Thank you so much for coming into um, episode 21, bitch. <gasps> damn, bitch. Dang. We waited till episode 21. Wait, no, period. I love it. A- episode 21. 21 my lucky number. So. No way. Yeah, that's oh, crazy. Oh, that's what that. I was like, oh wow. Oh, that was meant to be. Yeah. Oh, yeah. what the fuck? That's crazy, oh Peter. God. It was meant to be. Well, thank you, Peter, so much for coming on this episode. And we hope to see you in many more. Thank you guys for having me. This was such a blast. <sighs> well, you guys let and us know in the comments go down. Eat. Yeah, we're gonna go eat, y'all. Well, let's go for real. Period. You guys, oh eat? my god. We should either make like a seafood boil or eat those noodles, or whatever. I don't know. But anyways, mm, whatever is up to whatever. y'all. It's up to y'all. And I want some pizza. That place screen that you have by here, bitch. Mm-hmm. Has Peter tried it? I don't know. She's bussing. <laughs> bussing, yeah. All right, girls. Well, comment down below what was your favorite topic. And yeah. Thank right, you guys. guys for tuning in. And we'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye. Bye. Recently, we talked to you about Heal Girl Summer. And what's better self-care than skin? Girl, I've been struggling with my skin ever since I was pregnant with Mia. I get dark spots on my face and I have phases where they go away, but they're always lingering. So I struggle with discoloration in general. So we're super excited to try Clinique's even better clinical dark spot interrupter. If you have dark spots like me, it can often feel like a vicious cycle. As soon as one fades, another one pops up. Don't worry, girl. You can break the cycle with Clinique even better clinical dark spot interrupter. 
This powerful serum works on melanin rich to fair skin and helps visibly correct dark spots, such as acne marks, while protecting from future discoloration. What I really like is that 94% demonstrated an improvement in their skin tone, including acne marks, in just eight weeks, and a 39% visible reduction in dark spots in 12 weeks. Clinique's damage eraser is now more concentrated with boosted technology to deliver dramatic brightening results yet it's still gentle enough for all skin types. This product features a brightening molecule and vitamin C for a more even-looking skin tone, including acne marks. Plus, it improves the look of existing dark spots, including age spots, while interrupting the look of future dark spots too. In just two and a half hours, it helps quell redness from irritation that can trigger new visible spots and worsen existing spots. The amazing thing about this product is that it is oil-free, not actogenic, it is a fast-absorbing serum, and it is dermatologist-developed. Get even better clinical dark spot interrupter today, available at Clinique.com. Girl, this morning I had a big old bowl of sucaritas. It was so good. Girl, don't you mean frosted flakes? Well, in our culture, girl, I've also heard los del tigre, so. And what do you call Fruit Loops. Fruity Loopies, mama. Oh, Los del Tucan, right? There you go. And I also really like the the rooster one. You mean cornflakes? Oh my god, wait, that is cornflakes. The rooster one is cornflakes, but we call well, it cornflakes. Well, we call it cornflakes. Well, let's keep it 100, girl. My mom called every cereal <laughs> under the sun cornflakes. The special K2. The special K2, girl. My mom called literally uh, growing up. Everything is cornflakes, period. Comment below. You already know. So, Mia, are you teaching her, like, the different flavors, or are you calling them alcohol flakes, too? I refer to them just like my parents did growing up, because I, I actually find it really important to teach Mia both English and Spanish. Not just the language, but really incorporating, like, the lingo that we use. I will literally, like, bring out cereal and be like, you want conflays? You want socaritas? Because I want that implemented in her just like we grew up. Mm-hmm. And, Mama, that's why they say Kellogg's cereals are on Mom's tables aquí y allá. Period. <laughs> 